it is Lexi with the Pelican Girls. Here is Katrina with our other Pelican Girl. We're getting her out. We are at a thrift store and we're gonna take you along and see what we can find for our vintage boutiques. Let's go. You ready? ready? Thumbs up. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Let me see them Let me see them Hey y'all, we're gonna have to do a voiceover because you know how goodwill with their music. Um, so right here we're just kind of going through like the lamp section. And right here is like a lot of like they put the suitcases, bags, um, older luggage. And this section is where, well, the section kind of before this is where we found the Tell City magazine rack, um, which I haven't put out yet, but it's coming out soon. Um, here, Lexi's looking at um, vintage clothing that we are going to be adding to the boutique. This is a oversized kind of like cardigan type jacket. Uh, very popular, uh, probably like in the 90s, I would say. So right, so we're just going over it. Um, Lexi found this <laughs> safari looking shirt and I had looked at it too and it had like giraffes on it. This is my baby looking at some teddy bear shirts. I'm looking at where this kind of like a cat statue is made from. The <laughs> <laughs> uh, we just put it back. It didn't come home with us, of course. Uh, and just looking through stuff, you got to kind of dig so that you can find the real treasures. So when I picked up this bag, I thought it was like some embroidered um, like Christmas ornaments. Well, come to find out, they are not embroidery. They are paper. And the um, I thought maybe they were wood frames, but it's a plastic. They're plastic frames. Uh, I bought them, and <laughs> Lex will probably take them. I don't know what was going on with Goodwill this day that we were in, but the shelves were so empty. I did end up finding this beautiful, um, I would call it maybe a planter or a vase. It ended up being like, it's got, it's terracotta and it's painted over, but I love the shape of it and it's perfect for um, the spring revamp in the shop that I'm doing. So it's going to be perfect for spring, uh, for spring, absolutely perfect. And it's going to sell fast. So I'm, you know, I'm here loving it, of course, and it goes in the basket. I was, I took a look at this candlestick and I think it was just a little too overpriced for what you're getting. Um, candlesticks, it, that, that one was kind of small. We just kind of went through the shelves and just kind of, you know, you pick up stuff, you look for, for where it's from, you look at the bottom of it, you kind of just scour, you know, the shelves and see what you might find. Like I said, there wasn't a whole lot. This I was looking at, it looked like, um, I don't know, it was, it was kind of like a pottery, but more of like a bisque type. I don't really know how old it was. We sell a lot of birds in the shop, but I did not end up picking it up. Mugs, mugs, and more mugs. These totes weren't exactly our style, so we passed on all of this. Um, oh, and then, oh, look. Like I keep saying, oh yeah, Lex um, was looking at this. This is an older version of a Lazy Susan. You would put it like in your cabinet and put different things on it. We're dancing to the music here, apparently. 
going through the shelves, there was really not a whole lot. So we ended up coming into the clothing. Oh, and up oh, we're back into, I think these are like Scentsy Pots and stuff. Like I said, there wasn't a whole lot to look for on the shelves. This trip to Goodwill, sometimes there's just not what we're looking for. We're all, we're, we, we look for, um, you know, our vintage items. We look for brass. We look for, um, uh, right now we're looking for a lot of pottery and candlesticks that I can, you know, paint. This was a frame Lexi was looking at. All right, still going through. We Right here we're looking at these baskets, but we don't usually go for a light color basket. I like a darker colored vintage style basket, so but we didn't go. Now we're here, we are back in the clothing. Just trying to pick out some um, vintage clothing, vintage linens. We often find afghans in this section, um, which are very popular right now. We've sold um, a few, you know, in the boutique. But um, I don't think we found anything this time. But it's always a good place to look because you never know if you're going to find, like, tablecloths. Oh, here we are finding the perfect candlestick, the perfect size, the perfect price for me to paint and put in the boutique. These candlesticks like this sell very fast. I like to paint them pretty much a very neutral kind of stone looking color and uh, they do very well. This was a little collection of figurines. There was a lot of knickknack kind of just not really great items on the shelves. So we kind of lucked out. Hey! All right, it sucks in Goodwill that we cannot actually show the audio or whatever because like, we, we see all kinds of stuff, but um, the music's too loud. But we did pretty good. I think we did pretty good. Yes, yes. We got some key stuff that we can uh, we can flip. And, For and as bare as the shelves were. We did pick a few things. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so like yeah. that pot that she got is very yeah. much like what we're going for spring it's very much into the pottery it's, it's made out of terracotta so it's much it's very much into the spring look that i want to redo the shop in so it was heavy and very and like heavy. good yes solid and the candlestick i'm gonna paint we sell a lot of um re repurposed candlesticks yeah like refinished yeah yeah paint them up and they sell particularly the big ones Yes. I don't feel like you've ever been able to keep the big ones. They always go They're pretty all fast. They're right now. Um, and then we're tr we're going to try our hand at some vintage fashion in the boutique. We did some at our previous market, and it did pretty well. And we've had a few. Yes. You've had a few pieces. I had a couple like Christmas sweater type things, and which they all sold. sold. So we're we're kind of. She's even gonna buy a rack, which I. Yes. I'm, I'm the one who's like dragging my feet about it just because I don't want it to not work <laughs> and take up space but um but well, yeah I mean, so we got a sweater for I that. Mean, it's something to try if it doesn't work then we'll tweak it or whatever but I mean we've we're, we're also going to do some t-shirts so yes yeah, yeah so the rack so. you know and I and there's still other things so we have aprons we have some things in the shop yeah. that could probably fit on a rack yeah I think um, I think so. it, I think it'll work I, I think people are interested in vintage clothing so adding it to the shop it goes with the style mm -hmm. and stuff so and we like that younger demographic like my age and younger like like yes. 20s basically yes um we would like more of them in our shop yes not that we have any that sounds really ageist <laughs> we just want to expand our demographic because it's very on trend and it's very like, it's a big thing right now to have vintage items and to repurpose things and to use items that have been around for so long and so we want those people to realize that our shop's there right and, That's and the variety in our shop helps um, with all customers because it brings in different customers and they have more th more things to choose from yeah, like yeah. Uh, a grandma, a mother, and a daughter could all come in and shop. Right, right. That's and we, we get a lot of that. We get a lot of different generations coming in and shopping all together. Yeah. And we want everybody to be interested in our shop, yes. not just one demographic. Yeah. 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 So, mm -hmm. um, thanks for watching. And we will be doing more shop with us as we go um, and posting more videos. So, you should 
I mean, I say that a lot, but we really are going to do it this time. Follow our Facebook page. Yeah, um, follow us on Facebook. We have a lot more coming up. Uh, be sure to subscribe. Subscribe, <laughs> subscribe. like, and share. And uh, we'll see y'all next time. Bye. <laughs>